Without big data, progress in treating and curing diseases will go much slower. I think in order for big data to work, it's going to have to sell its benefits at the cost of privacy. Everyone around us standing here today has some sort of device, something on them that has the power to collect data, ranging from your heart rate, from your fitness tracker, to your DNA from an in-home genetic test, to even the zip code where you live or the emissions data of the environment within which you reside. The data are out there. The data will develop a learning healthcare system to be able to better predict how people might interact with diseases, with the healthcare system, to really be able to maximize the benefits and minimize the risks for people. Let's talk about the benefits. It's a big difference if you come in to see your doctor, your doctor says, you know, you got asthma, here's some drugs that I would prescribe for you, versus I've got a profile of your home, and guess what, you've got an environmental problem. And you may need to take these medicines, but if we can fix your home environment, um, it may take care of the problem. I think there's a little bit of hype around the big data side. I know there are people saying, you know, we're gonna cure everything and prevent everything and do everything. A lot of these systems are not talking to one another. Even if they were, we'd freak out. Somebody might say, I don't want my credit status linked up to my doctor visits. We have to work together across industry with all the different stakeholders in the healthcare system to build this learning healthcare system and make it meaningful. We gotta work this out. We can't go back to an era where we're all hiding out and hoping no one finds out who we are. We are going into an era of big data. There is no doubt about that. If this is a fight about when and how fast, and are you gonna put up some handrails or you're just gonna stumble down the stairs? We're at a critical juncture right now. We're really at a place where the data is there. We have the data, we can use it, but we haven't explored all the different facets of what it means to be implementing big data for healthcare, how to govern it, how to protect ourselves, and all the exciting possibilities that come with it.